What did you do when you were 16? Zach Bannock from Brewerton makes video games which are available on iTunes, and he's not even out of high school. Right now I'm in a basic introductory to video game design course um, where we just learned the basics of game development. We've made a few small prototypes, but nothing substantial. Although one of his games, Jetpack, appears basic like an old Nintendo game, everything about it is substantial. With schools focusing on science and English, Zach would like Central Square to look at this as a legitimate career path. Really, I would like them to further develop the video game design class we already have and maybe do some more advanced stuff because that could really be beneficial to the people already in the class. Jetpack is fun and interactive. You play as a tiny guy with a jetpack flying through gates to collect power-ups and rings. Zach's violence-free games have no cost on Androids and are only 99 cents for the iPhone. His mom isn't surprised as she has seen this from a young age. Since he could draw, uh, he, could, he drew video games on, like, we could never have enough paper in the house. We have boxes and boxes full of his video games that were drawn. And Dad agrees that it's a better job than most peers his age have, but it isn't all about the $1,000 he got. And that was before his game hit iTunes. It's amazing. It's, uh, I'm proud of him. I can't say enough about him. He loves doing it, and it's not like working in a store you make minimum wage. To him, it's not about the money. It's all about just having fun, making the games. Although Zach doesn't know what he wants to do in college, he will be an extra level up on everyone else. Reporting in Brewerton, I'm Alex Rasilla.